I ain't even finna fake it, child. I'm tired, okay? I'm tired. But my baby made this food, so I had to come on here and share with y'all right quick, right fast, okay? She made some chicken parm. Don't just look. Look at her. She been in this kitchen, child. We got some Cheddar Bay biscuits back here. You get you one. I put two up here. But we finna eat this right quick. Talk about a little something, something. Then we finna move on. I love y'all for real. Cause literally, I look like my child. Anyway, first of all, I bought this noodles. I want the chicken. <laughs> chicken is tenderer. She pounded it out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Say it one more time. Pounded it out. <laughs> she went to pound town. Okay, anyway. Yeah, look at it. Look at it, look at it. This is gonna be good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Burnt it inside my mouth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We got big noodles. <laughs> yeah. She always taking the words out of my mouth. Okay. Out of my head. Because I literally was about to say, if y'all don't know, I prefer angel hair. But I bought the big fat spaghetti noodles just for her. And watch how little. Mm. You hear the crunch? Mmm. Crunch? I'm the, oh. the good crispy chicken. <laughs> I was going to why are you eating pasta and it's crunchy? Let me know. Listen, y'all, we tired. Mm. This look bottle is good. I'm true. Look, how about, I told you Debo vibes had yeah. Chicken parm. I'm putting in his comments. Great minds think alike. My child been wanting this. Not and she finna man. cook it <laughs> tonight. <laughs> you know what's so weird? Like, I never had chicken parm in my life. But I know how to make it. Like, just off the dome. Man, I have no recipe. Mm -hmm. It's because it in your jeans. Yeah, my Italian jeans for real. My Nona and them. Yeah. They had talk. For sure. In my Please. past lives, girl, I done lived a lot. We, I believe it too. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly believe it. You have been here before. <laughs> mm. And you would think she would be over here eating her own food. Nope. She eating a flip. For those that know, no. <laughs> And don't come in the comments talking about tiddly diddly. <laughs> Frozen cups. <laughs> Freeze cup. Yes, I'm talking to you. If you call it that, do not say that in the comments. I don't want to hear it. I don't Does somebody hear really it. call it a tiddly diddly? Something like that. Something like a lily dilly or something. Yeah. I don't know where they from, but it <laughs> We from Florida in Orlando. That don't even matter. We yeah. call it a flip, okay? We call it a little flip. That's what my grandma them called it. That's what I'ma call it. That's what my kids call it. Mm. Mm -hmm. The noodles are perfect too. Oh. No, al dente. Okay. Calm down. Yeah. I still like my angel hair pasta. It's good though. And yes, I put a lot on here for y'all so you can get some. Shout out to Miss Pat. Oh, yeah. I'm our old neighbor. <laughs> was at. Mm. My aunt was asking me that. The other day, she was like, oh, do you miss Orlando? Orlando? 
he's biting up a storm right now. I don't know what's going on. Anyway, do you miss Orlando? And I was like, not really. They, I'm missing out on food. And only, I really just miss the like neighborhood. Yeah. Like the people. And some of the conveniences that we had that we didn't took for granted. Like having Lati up the road. Mm -hmm. Lati, for those that don't know, is like H Mart. Mm -hmm. Look at all that cheap. Ooh, that cheap. And um, we did not realize how much of a gold mine that they had brought to our neighborhood. To after we moved over here to the country, the country. Nope. No. <laughs> Stop looking at me. Stop it. I just, you know. Just gotta hear yourself. I'm proud of you because tick t uh breasts. Tick and breast just can go left. Mm hmm You not dry. Ain't dry. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Cause I know how to cook for it. You do. I do. You really do. Yeah, Ooh, I appreciate it. Looks them. so good. You want back? Yeah. You want back. They nice and thick. Ta ta. Ta ta. Mm. What is that? That's gonna, um, yeah, I know. Please move, please move. <laughs> mm. Ooh. Mm hmm. Yum. Mm -hmm. I ain't even give y'all no noodles for my bad. My bad. Mm. You put sugar in there? A little bit. Mm -hmm. Because most chicken pies be um, marinara sauce, which is more soft, uh, sugary. Mm. Oh, sugary. Sweet. Mm, 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 mm. So, yeah, thank you, first of all, for watching the previous video, which just dropped <laughs> a few minutes ago. <laughs> Um, I hope y'all enjoyed part one of the summer watch list. Today is not part two. Because <laughs> I got some more stuff to add to it. <laughs> but what I do want to talk about is the BET Awards, baby. Did y'all watch the B E T O Hearts? When I tell you this thing was ghetto, woo <laughs> wee. Now, performance wise, all of that seemed to go well. Except for, Except for Auntie Patty the Bell. Jesus. Auntie, just tell them no next time. I know that they, you was honored that they asked you to come down to the BET and sing for Tina Turner. But baby, when I tell y'all she ain't know the word, she's simply the best. And she kept saying, come on, y'all. I don't know if she was saying that to the, the choir that eventually came out <laughs> or to the audience to help us sing the words. To the, say it again, Mom. Huh? Say audience again. You gonna leave me alone? I'm not making fun of the me. audience. You have a little accent. I always have an accent. Okay. Long story short, it was a tragedy. They could. I mean, there's so many singers that they could have picked. Y'all called Patty. She had a whole um, Shaka Khan moment. She didn't know the words. It's really a Patty moment because she forgot her own words. They didn't have teleprompters because of the writer strike. So apparently nobody else can type in the teleprompter. I don't know. Y'all see that was too big a bite. Now calm down. <laughs> so I'm like. Where is the words? Why she don't know the words? 
Why she ain't practice? What in the world, Patty? Mm. Yeah, I ain't finna lie and say I know the word. I know simply the best. <laughs> Better than all the rest. <laughs> And the choir came out after a few minutes of her sounding horrible. Her voice didn't sound horrible. You just can't remember the words. And because they didn't have wires, they didn't have a host. So the main people who was talking was Kid Capri and MC Life. <laughs> the whole thing seemed to be celebrating 50 years of hip hop. Great idea, whatever, whatever. But again, no host. Um, Kid Capri kept going to the back during commercial breaks or during performances to change outfits 9-11 times. One time he didn't get back in time. And the camera, people, is that drink cold? I'm probably not. Um, the camera people are basically scanning the whole um, place they were in, the arena or whatever they was in. Um, while there's no music really playing. There's nothing going on. And he comes running out half, halfway together and gets on there and quickly. Because I was like, why could uh, MC Light didn't at least say something, banter, or do something? Nobody said nothing. It was quiet, and they were scanning the, the scene. I said, my God, today, this is ghetto. <laughs> mm. They honored um, Buster Rhymes. It's like icon of the year or whatever. Of the whatever. So they had like a lot of performances coming out. Performance. Performers. Lord, I can't talk today, y'all. I'm sad. Um, come out. Dougie Fresh was up there. Um. Just a bunch of people I can't name because my brain is not braining right now. But. <laughs> you just hit the camera. My bad. Shaking the people up. But at the end of the day, overall, all the performances was good. There was people I knew. There was people I didn't know. But everybody did a good job. Except for Auntie Patty. Um, at the end of the show, I don't even recall them really saying nothing. It was like the last performance was basically Busta Rhymes and all the people. And then at the end... It was just a bunch of dancers on the on the oh, stage. The uh, fifty years of dancers. Oh yeah. And then they was like, "Good night, everybody!" And then everybody was just standing, standing there. there, and people were dancing on the stage. They was doing TikToks. It was just, it was super. <laughs> mm -mm. It was ghetto. It was definitely ghetto, but. All the tributes, all the things they did, all the people we lost in the hip hop community, in the music community, actors, they named a lot of people. I didn't realize how many people we lost, to be honest. Let me pour this water out. I'm giving my spike. Cause I need a, a sizzly drink to go with this um, deliciousness. 
but the tweets my daughter is on twitter the tweets were hilarious she showed people arguing and cutting the food at the place people uh tweeting out other people trying to stay relevant natalie anyway uh, <laughs> <laughs> and, and you know what's so crazy it's Nat natalie who had the video of them fighting because it was ice spice and then they were apparently it was because ice spice and uzi had took a photo together and something else happened behind the scenes and jt was mad so we don't know. So I don't know, sister, but uh, I don't know, I don't know. And I don't care. <laughs> I know, sure. Who is that? For the young people, y'all know who them is. It was just a lot. Had a little spray. I need I don't know why red sauces always need a bubbly pizza. Tacos need a bubble. That is not red sauce. It is red. Tacos? It's got salsa on it. It's wow. red. <laughs> you know I don't like her, right? She get on my nerve. Anyway, we'll add some more. So if y'all watched the BET Awards, let me know in the comments what y'all thought, because I haven't watched it in years. Now, the only good thing about it for me as an old head, and they were celebrating 50 years, and I'm about to be 50, all the old school songs that I heard and was in here trying to dance to, that's probably why I'm tired now. <laughs> Cause I'm in here trying to dance and child. They they did the tootsie roll. They did the dougie. They did some of everything. <laughs> Artists I hadn't seen in years like Petra. Um, I can't think of that dude name. Who sang Freaks with um Dougie Fresh? Uh, he was little back then. But now he's a grown, grown man. The outfits, the costumes, the everything. Yeah, it was good. Oh, the other ghetto thing. Tiana Taylor won for best director. Yeah, I think she was best director. And her mama and a bunch of people came up on the stage and i don't know the i don't know which brand you which um um cell phone opens up like this you know what i'm talking about i think samsung or something like that well anyway they had one of those conveniently and she was like i'm gonna call her right now so she calls her on the stage now we this is live tv And she come up. She can be here. Let me call her right now. They call her on the little flip out phone, you know, flat, and put her up on the screen. And she's like, What happened? What happened? And she's like, You won. And she runs off the screen now. We're live TV. We ain't got time for all this theatrics. And you know it was a setup because the girl was fully beat down. Like her face was beat to the gods. Her hair was cute. Her outfit was cute. You know she was ready for this call. <laughs> but baby, what they weren't ready for is their choppy Wi-Fi. <laughs> baby, it was giving. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. <laughs> this is ghetto. So she thanked the people and her mama, um, the little bits and pieces I could hear. It was a mess. Um, Lotto, she won, and she took off one shoe before she could get up on the stage, but she ran up on the stage with one shoe on. Don't ask me why. It didn't make sense. 
Buster Rhymes said he had two minutes to give his speech. He took 10. <laughs> he cried like a little baby. And did all his name. I was like, right. y'all. I think it finished like 11 o'clock, 11.30, whenever it got done. I was exhausted. And I missed the first 30 minutes of the show. So I have no clue. They did a um a tribute to Offset, not Offset, Jesus. What's the baby that passed away? Gary, was it take off, take off, take off. <laughs> Take off. They did a tribute to him. That was that was really nice. Like I said, overall, the performances and everything was good. Everything went well. Um, I low key feel like this is the first time I've seen them break the stage down, and they still had the cameras pointing at the stage, and you can see the people running out, grabbing people's props off the stage. I don't remember seeing that before because they usually would pan somewhere else. Child, it was, yeah, it was a lot. Anyway, if you've seen it, let me know in the comments. Thank y'all so much for joining me. This was way too much pasta. But aesthetics, you know, we put it up here so y'all can get y'all a little piece off of here. <laughs> um, Baby girl, she in the back right now. This is very delicious. I'm so happy that you had a craving for this and you wanted to make it. So thank you for that. Appreciate it. <laughs> if you're new to my channel, I'm Official Jamia. We also have a podcast channel, another mother-daughter podcast. I know we have not posted in like two, three months, but we're going to post over there. Going to watch the other videos now so you'll be ready for when we do drop some new content over there. Make sure you also check out my members. This always listed in the description below. Woo! To my rider dies. Y'all know what to do. Ursha and the new people. If they say they new, go on to Ursha or me. Ursha, welcome in. <laughs> Behave accordingly. <laughs> Anyway, as I always say, I love you and ain't nothing you can do about it. I'll see y'all on the next video. And I promise I'm a little more alive next time. I promise. Y'all getting the dress down, Jamie, the other day. Because uh, it's hot, too. It's very, very hot in Florida right now. Not as hot as Texas, but very hot. <laughs> Shout out to my sister in Texas and all my peoples in Texas. Because is too hot. Anyway, I'll see y'all on the next video. Bitch!